from always sneaking up on us. Perhaps if I applied my intellect to this problem, I could figure out a way to... Clumsy, you're not listening. Huh? Oh, I'm sorry, Brainy. I was listening to the bells. Aren't they the Smurfiest? Bells? Bells? A bell? Mm, why not a bell? That's it, a bell! Clumsy, you've done it. You've given me a Smurf-tastic idea. I did? Gosh, I didn't even know I had one. Come on. Time and tide wait for no Smurf. Papa, Papa Smurf! Smurf! Papa, Papa Smurf! Smurf! Where's Papa Smurf? Well, you're too late for Papa Smurf. He and Smurfette went out into the woods to look for orchids. Gosh, maybe we'd better wait, right? Wait? This brilliant idea cannot wait. Besides, Papa Smurf has always told us to act for ourselves, hasn't he? <laughs> Tell him about your idea, Brady. Tell him about putting a bell on Israel. A bell on Azriel? So he won't be able to sneak up on us anymore. Hmm, not a bad idea. The only thing wrong with it is it's Brainy's idea, and I've never seen an idea of Brainy's work yet. All that remains between this brilliant idea and its execution is finding the proper bell. A bell of such pure tone. Brainy. A bell with such a distinct ring. A bell. Brainy. Yes, Andy. We'll make the bell. <laughs> Yum. How's it coming, Handy? Almost ready to pour. Now, if Handy had followed my advice, this entire project would have been completed long ago. But, oh, no, he... Chateaubriand, here they come. Is it ready? It is. Well, this is certainly not the technique I had in mind. Now, if Papa Smurf were here, I know he would certainly agree with me. <laughs> la, 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 la. This must have been quite an education for you, Baby Smurf, to witness firsthand the age-old art of bell-making. My fellow Smurfs, I give you Azriel's bell. Now, whenever Azriel tries to sneak up on a poor unsuspecting Smurf, that Smurf will hear him coming. Yay! But somebody has to put the bell around Osriel's neck. Oh. Now, who is going to have the honor of tying the bell onto Osriel? Who is going to be that lucky Smurf? Any volunteers? Hey, wait! Hey, gosh, everybody, wait! Well, there's only one Smurf who deserves the honor of putting that bell on Azriel. And that's the Smurf who fucked the whole thing up in the first place. Right? Right. And Brainy gets my vote. <laughs> Me? No, no, it, it wouldn't be fair. Listen, naturally, it is a great honor, but really, I couldn't. Oh, sure you could, Brainy. Well, you shush. Dear friends, though I truly appreciate your confidence, I must insist we all have an equal opportunity. Thus, we will draw straws. Uh, a best out of three? <laughs> Boy, I sure admire your courage, Brady. Boy, you wouldn't catch me going anywhere near Azrael, let alone tying a bell around his neck. Boy, you just ain't scared of nothing. I mean, you don't even care about Azrael's claws or them sharp teeth or... Clumsy. Huh? Shh. That's just what I was about to say. There he is. That's mean old Azrael, all right. Now's your chance. Um, well, now, I wonder if it's right to bother the poor cat while he's sleeping. I mean, we all need our rest. Shh. Go. 
Well, good luck, Brainy. Watch out for them teeth now. What's going on out here? Hmm, well, what have we here? A bell, and no doubt put there by those despicable Smurfs. Serves you right, you stupid cat. Did they really expect this simple-minded trick to work? The fools! I'll show them a trick. I'll show them a bell! <laughs> Oh, bell of copper, bell of tin, make your awful awesome din. When e'er a smurf doth pass ye by, with a hey nanny nanny and a spit in your eye. Well, it has to rhyme, you know. <laughs> now for the test, and... Look, Azriel, I'm a smurf. Isn't it smurfy? I'm the smurfiest. Oh, how smurfy! <laughs> it works, Azriel, it works! Now, whenever there's a smurf about, this bell will alert us, like so. And no matter where they run or where they hide, this little bell will lead us to the spot. Now, to put the bell back on. Come here, you miserable beast. Come back here! How dare you defy me, you fool cat! There. Now you can earn your keep. Let the smurf hunt begin! <laughs> This is the most beautiful orchid I've ever found. It certainly is, Smurfette. Shh! What is that noise? I had better take a look. Oh, be careful, Papa Smurf. Faster, Azriel, faster. The bell senses a Smurf. Good grief. Lead on, little bell. Lead on. What is it, Papa Smurf? Gargamel. Gargamel? Gargamel and Azriel are headed right for us. Hurry. They're heading upstream, Azriel. Faster, Smurfette, they're gaining on us. Uh, uh, I'm running as fast as I can, Papa Smurf. Across the bridge. <laughs> We're getting closer. We can hide in those rocks. They're trapped, Azriel. They're trapped. That bell, it's leading them right to us. We'll double back to the river. Hurry, Azriel. They're heading back to the river. We'll never lose them this way. Follow me. Oh, they must have gone across to the other side again. Oh, drat, we lost them. And no matter where we hid, that little bell on Azrael's tail seemed to lead them right to us. Hey, that sounds like our bell. Your bell? Yeah, we made it. And Brady got to hang it on Azrael since the whole thing was his idea. <laughs> Aren't you proud of him, Papa Smurf? Hmm. It seemed like a good idea at the time. <laughs> And Gargamel took your idea and used it against us. Now, instead of warning us, the bell is hunting us. I told you it was a dumb idea. I hate ideas. Well, it was a good idea, Brainy. And now we must come up with another idea. And I think I know just what to do. This should do it. This should do it very nicely. My little Smurfs, we are going to find Azrael and take care of that bell. Are you ready? Yes, yes Papa, Papa Smurf. Listen, the bell. Hey, God, that sounds like our bell. That is our bell. That means... That means they found us. We're getting close again, Azriel. Over there. You know what to do. Yes, yes Papa, Papa Smurf. Smurf. Over there. We must be onto a whole flock of them. <laughs> Azriel, help! Help! Yoo-hoo, Azriel! <laughs> here, kitty, 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 kitty. Hey, Azriel, over here!
feline. Get up. The place is crawling with Smurfs. Over there. Up here. We're getting closer. Prepare for your doom. You wake, Big Mouth. He no lie. Now, Big Mouth mad. You don't catch Smurfs. You don't catch Smurfs because they're smart and you're not. Face it, Gargi. This mop has more brain power than you do. More brain power? Why, you miserable little... Wait, wait, wait. That's it. That's it. The reason that the Smurfs outsmart me is because they outnumber me. They're a hundred times smarter because there are a hundred of them. But if I were a hundred times smarter, that would more than balance the scales. If you ask me, it's not the scales that are unbalanced. Quiet. Let's see now. Bats, blisters, boils, brains. Ah, ha, ha, here it is, Scruple. A brain-boosting formula. This will increase my brain power at least a hundred times. A lot of good that'll do. A hundred times zero is still zero. And then I, Brainy Smurf, single-handedly... Brainy, please. Can't you see we're trying to get ready for the big storm? <laughs> Wait till you read the new book I'm going to write, Brainy the Brave. Now every Smurf will be able to read about my heroics, my bravery, my fearlessness, my... Brainy? Brainy? Can I come out now? Ah, my moment of supreme triumph is here at last. This brain-boosting potion will turn me into the greatest evil genius of all time. Too bad the potion only lasts 24 hours. It worked. Hey, I, I think. <coughs> hey, wait, 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 what was that? <coughs> I don't know, but it looks like trouble. <laughs> what did you put in that potion? I, 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 I can't remember. Now, what's that stupid cat doing? From now on, you can call me your magnificence. Who 
when I'm finished with you, a more suitable name might be Flying Furball. Huh? <laughs> ouch! 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 Oh, stop! Yikes! I don't like the sound of this. Now what? <gasps> Why, this is genius! Osriel has invented the ultimate Smurf catching machine. It's brilliant, and all because of my brilliant brain boosting formula. Oh, yeah? Well, I'd like to see the furry flea bag try and build it. <coughs> oh, no! If you think I'm gonna build this contraption, you've got another thing. Ouch! <laughs> Since you put it that way, uh, I'd be happy to build it. That's my Azriel. Never do anything yourself if you can find someone dumber to do it for you. <laughs> hey, that's not fair. Finished at last. Now maybe I can get some sleep. Sleep? How can you think of sleep? With this Smurf catching machine, soon the Smurfs will be all mine! Where have you watch this? Looks like Azriel wants you to build some sort of giant mouse trap. Yeah, but, but, but I thought we were going to catch Smurfs. Yeah, yeah. Ah, ooh, ooh. Bye -bye. Ooh, I hate that rotten cat almost as much as I hate those rotten Smurfs. Smurf over here, and you smurf over there. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, I found it! I found the Smurf ball. And that's not all. Well, uh, where is it, Clumsy? Uh, this hair funny-looking snake just ate it. Careful, Clumsy. I've never seen a snake like this before. <laughs> I wonder what's gotten into Azrael. And suddenly, there he was, the creature from the brackish lagoon. I, Brainy the Brave, threw myself at him and holding him as tight as I could. Help! Help! Smurf the alarm! I'm a smurf and the others have been captured by Azrael! Huh? And there's no need to fear. Come on, every smurf! It's Brainy to the rescue! Oh! Some here. Looks like my brain boosting formula must be wearing off, Scruple. Because this goofy getup makes no sense at all. For once, Gargi, I have to agree with you. Even some of your plans have made more sense. All done, your exalted furriness. <laughs> How about a nice little Smurf snack? <laughs> Yowch! Azriel, please be reasonable. Would I ever treat you this way? <laughs> but, but, but I've given you the best years of my life. I don't see Gargamel, and it looks like Azrael's sound asleep. What are we gonna do? Uh, do? Uh, well, uh, maybe we better not rush into this uh, so quick. <clears throat> Whatever happened to Brainy the Brave? Well, I, uh, uh, that is, um... Well, Brainy, if you're not gonna help rescue Papa Smurf and the others, I will! Come on, let's get Smurfin! <laughs> hey, wait for me! <laughs> 
Uh, maybe I'd better find a nice, safe place to hide. Uh, I mean, to uh, keep a lookout. Sure, Brainy. We better smurf open the cage before Azrael wakes up. <laughs> Don't worry, Papa Smurf. We'll get you out in no time. Uh-oh. <laughs> 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 This is terrible. I'd better go tell Papa Smurf. <gasps> I forgot Papa Smurf's already been captured. Now this really is terrible. Look, Cardi, that was no mouse trap Asriel had us build. It was a Smurf trap. Whoever said a dog was man's best friend? <laughs> We're going to eat good tonight. <laughs> you? What about me? Ow! Oops. It's that rotten smurf with the glasses. <laughs> nice, kitty, 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 kitty. <laughs> Whoa! Careful, you crazy cat. <laughs> nice smurf and brainy. It was. I mean, you're absolutely right. It was. Yes, I owe you an apology. But right now, you better leave every Smurf out of here. Great Smurfs! It looks like Azrael is about to attack again. Run, my little Smurfs, run! Hey, Gargi, looks like your brain boosting formula's finally worn off. Huh? You'd better hope that cats do have nine lives, because you're going to need every last one of them. Hey, what is that? What is it? It isn't food. It's a surprise! Yeah! <laughs> oh. I should have known he'd smurf me. Hey, Hefty, I brought you a surprise. I guarantee you'll get a big bang out of it. <laughs> Present for you, lady. Huh? What? Oh, uh, uh, when? It's a surprise. <laughs> Funny, Jokey. It sure was. <laughs> Present for you, Smurfette. Why, thank you, Jokey. Surprise, surprise. Jokey Smurf, one of these days you're going to get it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Boy, that Jokey sure is a pain. Ooh, what he needs is a good smurfing. He's always pulling those silly jokes. That last one ruined my flowers and my dress. <laughs> what was that? What? <laughs> that? <laughs> oh, greedy. I'm a monster. Yeah. Where's Papa Smurf when you need him? Oh, this is so scary. <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> you should see the smurfy look on your faces. Jokey! <laughs> oh, smurf your face, Jokey. Very funny. Very funny. How can a Smurf get any sleep with you around, Jokey? Were you ever scared? I really smurfed you that time. <laughs> One of these days, Jokey Smurf. Boy, oh boy, Lazy. This Smurf wood is really getting heavy. I can barely eat. Smurf 
up, lazy. Put some oomph in it. <laughs> We all know how Papa Smurf likes to be disturbed. <laughs> Lazy! No Smurf is ever to interrupt me when I'm working. Look at the mess you made! <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is going to be the smurfiest one yet. Hold it. Hold it a minute, Lazy. I just smurfed something delicious. This is going to be smurfier than I thought. Yum, yum. <laughs> hey, Greedy, I didn't know you could fly. <laughs> 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 You again, Jokey Smurf. This time you've gone too far. Had to smurf it up a little before my morning's chores. <laughs> Ta -da! <laughs> Jokey's gonna get it one of these days. He tricked Lazy too, I bet. Well, I say we give Jokey a taste of his own medicine. Yeah, a big taste. But what about my beautiful music? <laughs> Boy, first lazy, then greedy, then the Smurfette. What a great day! <laughs> Here he comes. Okay, every Smurf start giggling. You're supposed to giggle, lazy, not snore. <laughs> <laughs> What's all the laughing? <laughs> What do 
my smell in my house. Is it those wretched Smurfs? One, two, three, push! <laughs> Ariel! <laughs> no, Ariel, don't do anything we'll regret. Aha! What an unexpected snack, my wretched, disgusting little Smurf. <laughs> I will, Smurfette, I will, right into my soup pot. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Yeah, Ezreal. Oh, Smurf is me. This is getting less funny by the minute. <laughs> it was thoughtful of you to come just at lunchtime, my tasty little Smurf. <laughs> Another tasty smurf for the pot. Well, this must be my lucky day. Oh, wait, Gargamel! Wait? Wait for what? Here, I, I, I brought you a special present. A present? For me? Oh, how disgustingly nice. Are you all right, Jokey? Yeah, just get ready to climb out of here. With Gargamel standing there? This is no time for jokes, Jokey. But this time, the joke's on Gargamel. Just be ready. Let's see what the sniveling little Smurf brought me, Azriel. <laughs> Ooh, how I hate Smurfs, Azriel. <laughs> well, at least we still have our main course, Azriel. Soup a la Smurf. Gone? Why, those disgusting, miserable... What's this? Another? Perfect timing, eh? <laughs> <laughs> That's a smurfly perfect. <laughs> they got away! My net, my club, my kingdom for a smurf! Yeah, yeah, yeah! <laughs> that was so smurfy. Oh, how I hate them! I'll get those miserable Smurfs if it's the last thing I ever do! And it may be. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so you see, Brainy, for once, Jokey's pranks really paid off. Yeah, <laughs> he really burned Gargmel up. But does this end justify the means? A practical joke's ever really a means yeah, to a smurf, yeah. perhaps. And I only say, perhaps, there is the proper time and a place for those kinds of jokes. Hey, Brady! Yeah, 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 yeah. That's not funny. Ooh, I created you to help me, Smurfat. <gasps> And you failed! Uh, but now, I will have my revenge. Look! <laughs> Papa Smurf can no longer protect you, for I have stolen his powers. Oh, no, no! Yes, yes! <laughs> oh, no, not Papa Smurf. He hasn't lost his powers. He can't. He mustn't. Oh, what a nightmare. And it was so real. I better make sure Papa Smurf is okay. Morning, Smurfette. Would you like a fresh chocolate Smurf puff? Uh, no, thanks, Greedy. But have you seen Papa Smurf anywhere? Well, I, uh... Greedy Smurf, when will you learn that you must eat to live and not live to eat? And as far as Papa Smurf is concerned, Smurfette, he is working in his lab, and I can tell you that Papa Smurf's been working much too hard. All oh, work and no Smurf makes Smurf a very dull fur. That's what I... Experiment number 15. Add six drops of lemon and stir. Oh, Smurfle sticks, another failure. Oh, no! Papa Smurf, are you all right? <coughs> yes, 
Yes, Smurfette, I'm fine. <coughs> about the explosion? Nothing to worry about, my dear. Now, run along. I have work to do. Yes, Papa Smurf. What a fine Azriel! With this spell, I can turn metal into gold. Do you hear, Azriel? Metal into gold! <laughs> I'll be rich, 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 rich! Let me see. Uh, uh, I'll need one gram of serpent venom. Yes, yes, yes. And with the first rays of dawn, add a half a pound of dissolved Smurfs? <laughs> oh, no! Uh, but I have no Smurfs! <laughs> Half a pound of dissolved smurfs, hmm? Let's see. One, two. Well, that would be about ten smurfs. Well, I'll get them. I'll get them! <laughs> From inside to outside, as smurf I command, each throw and divide and cover the land. Anywhere I can find some Smurf and quiet around here? I can't understand it, Farmer Smurf. Something is wrong with my fast-growing formula. I think Papa Smurf is losing his power. Papa Smurf's losing his powers? Oh, boy, all this excitement is wearing me off. Oh, boy! Bird, ah. come out of here! One down and nine to go. I really think my scary dream is coming true. Maybe, maybe Papa Smurf is losing his touch, you know, getting old. Oh, but he just had his 542nd birthday. 542? That's not old. I hate 542. Hmm, these are going to make a delicious cake. <gasps> I must be dreaming. Hey, what's moving on? This cake is glue. <laughs> <laughs> Only on the outside, greedy little Smurf. <gasps> Gargamel! <laughs> Two down and eight to go. <laughs> Another present? And it's even Smurfier than mine. Experiment number 23, and still searching for the proper ingredients. Uh, I can't see. Let's hope this works. Smirkness gracious. I'll have to tell the Smurfs I'm going. Unfortunately, I have had unsuccessful results with my latest experiments. So, I must travel to the Mountain of Mists for some special routes. Oh, Papa Smurf, please don't go. Don't worry, Smurfette. I'll return before nightfall. No, Papa Smurf, you mustn't go. Smurfette, is something wrong? Oh, oh no, Papa Smurf. I, I just wondered if uh, you might need a rest. Rest? Nonsense. Now be good Smurfs until I return. Now to work. Well, well, what are you going to do to us? <laughs> yeah. I'm going to see what your weight is worth in gold. A measly three ounces, and I need a half pound. Hmm. My traps are brilliant, but much too slow. I need more Smurfs. Fast! <laughs> but how? Hmm. We don't have to worry. Papa Smurf will save us. But Smurf, that told me Papa Smurf was... Was losing his powers. Losing his powers? Of course. Azriel, no! <laughs> Thank you, vile Smurfs. You have given me just the idea I was looking for. <laughs> dum -de -dum -de -dum. <laughs> for Smurf eyes only. Well, I'm a Smurf. <gasps> Look what I found! Listen to this! Under the red oak, this note set. I send bad news with no regret. Four Smurfs must come once every hour, or Papa Smurf will lose all power. Oh, see? That proves it. Papa 
Smurf is losing his power. Reckon you saw my pumpkin patch explode? And we were attacked by flying vegetables. We have to do something. Quiet! I hate quiet. There's only one thing to do. We've got to go to the Red Oak. It's the least we can do. I don't see anything. Shh. Come on. We're not going to find out anything under here. I don't like the looks of this place, Papa Smurf says. Look out! <laughs> well, well, well. What have we here? Must be at least half a pound of miserable, vile Smurfs. <laughs> Let's go, Azriel. I have gold to make. And if there's a Smurf left over, Azriel, perhaps I'll let you eat him. Azriel? Ah, we've got to find Papa Smurf. Oh, uh, yeah. He'll know what to do. Uh, maybe. Oh, perfect, perfect. Tomorrow, with the first rays of dawn, I'll change them into gold, and I'll be rich, rich, rich. <laughs> I'd like to give that Gargamel a half a pound right in the nose. I just hope Papa Smurf shows up in time. I wouldn't count on it, Jokey. We'd better get out of here on our own. Yeah, but how? Oh, clumsy. I think we're lost. Uh, we're not lost, Smurfette. We just don't know where we are. Oh, someone's coming. Oh, how scary. Don't be afraid, Smurfette. I'll, I'll protect you. Papa Smurf! Oh, we were so scared. Thank Smurf, it's you. Smurfette, clumsy. What's wrong? It's Gargamel. He's trapped a whole net full of Smurf. Oh, uh, yeah. I heard him say he's going to turn him into gold. Gold? Hmm. I have a plan, but I'll need your help. Quickly, back to my lab. What are you doing, Papa Smurf? Why, making some gold for Gargamel, of course. Just do what I told you, and everything will be fine. Okay, Papa Smurf, if you say so. You're a very brave little Smurfette. It's dangerous, Clumsy, but I know you can do it. <laughs> Don't worry about me, Papa Smurf. Soons will boil, and I wonder which one of you will dissolve first. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Will it be you? Yo! Why, you... What's that? Why, it's gold! I'll be rich, Azriel. Rich, rich, rich. What's this? It's Papa Smurf. He's behind all this. I'll get them for this, Azriel. I'll get them all. Behold, 
Azriel, the first day of spring. Spring with its flowers, its birds, its sunshine, its... its disgusting! Oh, an entire winter has passed and I haven't captured a single smurf! <coughs> but wait! <coughs> All this sickening sweetness has given me a brilliant idea. It may be spring, but those rotten little smurfs will never see summer! <laughs> <coughs> Ah, oh, spring is in the air. It's probably just spring fever, a harmless phenomenon. Yoo! Hi, Papa Smurf! Hey, Smurfette! Hi, Smurfette! Hi, Smurfette! Hi, Hmm, so much for the harmless theory. Hey, Smurfette! These are for you. No, 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 Will you marry me? Oh, well, well, well gosh, Hefty, I, 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 uh... No, marry me! No, 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 me. no, 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 no. Smurfs! You ought to be ashamed, pestering poor Smurfette like that. Now run along. I apologize for their behavior, Smurfette. Uh, uh but if you do decide to marry, uh, <laughs> you might consider an older, more mature, uh, Smurf of the world. Well, I... Just think, you'd be known as Mama Smurf. Well, I... And not only that... Uh, I, I, I have to be uh, smurfing along now. <sighs> if only I were 450 years younger. <laughs> There's nothing like a lovely spring surprise to snare a Smurfette. And once I have that little blue double-crosser in my clutches, I will use her to do what I created her to do. Destroy the Smurfs! <laughs> I don't blame you for getting all choked up, Azriel. It's my most brilliant plan ever! Borrow your uh, exercise machines? Oh, sure. <laughs> Thank you. Hmm, that's funny. I wonder if... No, nah, he's too old. She loves me. She loves me now. She loves me. She loves me now. She loves me. She loves me now. She loves me now. Oh, this is getting serious. I'd better talk to Papa Smurf. She loves me? Yeah, she loves me not. She loves me? Yeah, she loves me not. Coming! Yes? Uh, oh, a Smurfette. Papa Smurf, I think it's time I made a choice and picked which Smurf I'll marry. Yes, and, and? And, so I'm going to go for a long walk and think. Oh. When I return, I'll announce my decision. Uh, just remember, my dear, youth isn't the only thing to consider. Eek! Oh, you 
this startled me. What a pretty flower. Yes, oh great wizard, Gargamel, I am coming. Come in, Smurfette, we've been expecting you. Now, here's what you're going to do. You... I know I can do it. You might as well all go home. Smurfette's gonna pick me. You're off your Smurf, Hefty. She's gonna pick me. You mean me? Oh, me! Yeah. Look at me! Pick me. 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 Oh. <laughs> Poor little Smurfs don't realize that this time they're outclassed. Yeah, I'm back. Well, Smurfette, have you decided which Smurf you're going to uh, marry? I sure have. I've chosen Handy because of his brain. Handy. Chosen Hefty for his bra. Hefty. Uh, Smurfette, couldn't you narrow your decision down to to just one Smurf? Oh, I'm sure they can work this out between them, and may the best Smurf win. She means me, Handy. Oh no, I was her first choice. Oh yeah. Yeah. She picked Handy. No, she picked. Handy. A one and a two and a three and a... Smurf at the choice is clear. The Smurf of your dreams is here. Forget about Hefty and all the... A one and a two and a three and a... Smurf at the choice is clear. A Smurf of your dreams is here. Of your dreams is here. Forget about Hefty and all the rest. Yours truly handy is still the best. The only spark for you. The only spark for you. Is one who is too blue. That's Smurf is me. My name is Hefty. Smurf at the choice is clear. The Smurf of your dreams is here. The only choice for you is one who is too blue. Forget about Hefty and all the rest. Handy is still the best. That's Smurf is me. My name is Hefty. So let's say I do. Wait a minute. You just I got a Smurf don't hand you. What's the matter with you, Smurfs? Now go home and get some sleep. Smurfette, this fighting has got to stop. Oh. But isn't it romantic, Papa Smurf? 
in this flower. Gargamel! hum de dum de dum Rainy, what are you doing? Papa Smurf's orders. I'm smurfing a line through the center of the village to keep Hefty's group and Handy's group from fighting over you. Oh, Rainy, I just love the way you paint. It's so, so smurfly. Really? <laughs> Yes. May I help? Well, uh, sure. Hum de dum de dum. Uh, a little more to the right, Rainy. Thanks, Smurfette. Hum de dum de dum. That's it. Now to the left. Right, you are. Hum de dum de dum. I hate hum de dum de dum. I must find a way to break Gargamel's spell on Smurfette before my little Smurfs destroy the village and each other. Um de dum de dum, um de dum de dum, um de dum de dum. Rainy, what do you think you're doing? Papa's orders. You and your rowdy friends are to stay on this side of the line until. <laughs> Tell Papa Smurf on you. And when Papa Smurf hears about this, he... Papa Smurf! My, my. If it's not dear, sweet, handy and hefty, letting a little old line stand in your way. Uh, it's not my way. But I dare you to smurf over this line, handy. Well, handy? Uh, um, uh, uh... Oh, yeah? Smurfs will be Smurfs. Eureka! I've Smurfed it! Smurfette! My dear little Smurfette! Look! I found a cure for your... Stop! Stop! It's gone! They won't even listen to me anymore. There's only one thing left to do. <laughs> Smurfette should have those rotten little Smurfs at each other's throats by now. Yeah. We'll boil a pot of water and be ready to make Smurf soup. <laughs> <laughs> Papa Smurf! Uh, hello, Gargamel. <laughs> Your days of Smurfing are over, Papa Smurf. Uh, just a moment. Let's discuss this calmly. Oh, very well. But you won't leave here alive. <laughs> well, Gargamel? I'm having serious problems with my Smurfs. Yes, I know. And I need you to look into my eyes. That's perfect. Tit for tat, make this like that. What? What, what, what happened? We have exchanged physical appearances, Gargamel. But, but, but that's dishonest. That's what it is! Dishonest! You swindler! You cheat! You phony! Up here, Scott! Up here, you poor brain! If you want to eat a smurf, eat him! Leave me alone! I want to be you again. I mean, me again. Gargamel again. I don't want to stay like this. Don't worry, neither do I. When I've restored peace to the Smurf village, we'll change back. How? By looking into each other's eyes again and reciting the magic spell. Well, then, then look into my eyes now. Flick, flack, change me back. No, 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 that's not it. A bit back, make me... Oof. Did you hurt yourself? Don't touch me, you disgusting Smurf. What a wizard! All for Smurf and Smurf for all! Come on, you Smurfs! All together now! Charge! Get out of hell! Don't worry, Smurf! 
Oh, dear. They're attacking me. Oh, I'm so scared. It's working. They've stopped fighting one another. Oh, they've got me. That rotten Papa Smurf, he's ruining my bad name. But I'll bet the spell to change me back is somewhere in Papa Smurf's lab. Well, let's see. Better homes and potions. No, 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 that's not it. Uh, magical spells for blue or blues. No, no, no. Aha! The art of physical change. I knew I'd find it. <laughs> Smurfo's not tight. Drive those snakes deep. Take that and that and that. Poor Master Gargamel. I must save him. <laughs> well done, little Smurfs. Now you know that united we Smurf, divided we fall. <laughs> and now you can untie me because I'm not really Gargamel. I'm your own dear Papa Smurf. Sure, and I'm Smurfette. <laughs> <laughs> but, but I, I'm serious. Now untie me. Nothing Smurfing, Gargamel. Oh, stop them, Papa Smurf. You're so strong and brave and fair and... Get lost, you little worm. I'm Gargamel, and I don't need you anymore. Gar Gargamel? See this? I found your secret spell. Gargamel! Now look into my eye. Never! No, wait! Tit for tat, make this like that. <laughs> he, he is Gargamel. Oh, I feel so guilty. Run, my dear little Smurfs. I've got you, and I'll get the rest of you, too. <laughs> Go ahead, run. You can't escape me. Get ready. Here he comes. Oh, rat. Where did they go? Ha-ha! Ready-made Smurf kebab! <laughs> I, 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 I hate Smurf kebab! Smurf for your lives! This is not logical. Papa Smurf is Gargamel. Or is Gargamel Papa Smurf? Because if Gargamel isn't Papa Smurf, then Gargamel is... Gargamel! Run for your Smurfs! This way! <laughs> Asriel! We're Smurf for sure! <laughs> I don't get it. If you want to eat a Smurf, eat him and leave me alone. Ouch! Stop, Azriel! What are you to ouch? Oh. Go on, Azriel! Smurf him a lesson! Good kitty! Never mind that, Smurfs. Let's get back to the village, fast. You fur-brained feline, look what you've done. You've let all the Smurfs escape. Oh, no matter. Now I know where the village is. <laughs> it's this way. I remember it distinctly. Then I turn right at this tree. Uh, or is it left? Uh, then right again. And again. Uh, funny. I, I don't remember this. Ah! There it is ahead! <laughs> My own hovel? Oh, no! Oh, those rotten, miserable little blue beggars have done it again! <laughs> Someday I'll get them! Someday! How nice to see my good little Smurfs happy once more. Hi, Papa Smurf. Smurfy day, huh? Hello, Smurfette. Yes, it... Hey, Smurfette! Hi, hey, hey, Smurfette! Hey, 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 so, uh, who are you going to marry, Smurfette? It's me. Yeah, it's me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. You'll marry me. Well, um, I, uh... How about someone short, blue, and handsome, Smurfette? Well, I... No, she's going to marry me, aren't you, Smurfette? But I... Uh... You're all Smurf in the head. It's me she loves. But no, you mean me. No, me. 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 Stop. Cease. Hold it. There will be no more of this. Smurfette, you must make a final decision once and for all. I, I, I've already thought it over, Papa Smurf, and I've decided. Yes? That I'm too young to get married. Oh. Besides, I could never pick just one of you, because I love you all. Yay! Oh, no! A 
as a wise Murph once said, there's always next spring. Uh, I reckon this be the worst drought in a smuffy long time. The heat be wilting my brain as well as my cabbage. It can't get any worse. What a day. I'm ready to melt. Ah, oh, yeah, and it's even too hot to sleep. Worst of all, it's too hot to eat. Almost. I know how to beat this heat. I'll make a big pitcher of Smurf berry juice, and I won't share it with anybody. <laughs> oh, no! No Smurf berries? And no Smurf berries means no Smurf berry juice. If this formula works, it will enlarge little clouds into big clouds. Then we'll have rain at last. Uh-oh. Easy, huh? <laughs> Down, boy! Wait! Uh, hold it! Stop! If I can just reach the elfin root, I will... I will... I will... Well, my enlarging mixture certainly works. Now to use it on the clouds. Wow! I'll bet that mixture would smurf up some big fat smurf berries real fast. I'll just mix up a teeny tiny bit. Ooh, hefty. You sure are nice to carry all these heavy rocks out of my garden, especially in this heat. <laughs> Ooh, you're so strong. Huh? If I had done that, I'd just collapse. Bye now. Oh. <laughs> Smurf berry juice will soon be a reality, and it will all be mine. Oh! <clears throat> I'll have to go and mix up some more. Hey! What happened? Now maybe it's the heat and I'm just dreaming. Oh! It's no dream! Papa's <laughs> Now how did I do this? A dash of dandelion dust? A touch of tree toad sweat? Papa's Smurf! Papa's Smurf! Uh-oh, somebody's coming. Papa Smurf, it's me, Hefty. Please open up. <laughs> Hefty, there is no need to make such a big, 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 big... Ah! He's a m -m -m monster Quick, Brainy, where's Papa Smurf? He's got to help me. I was just resting at the bottom of Smurfberry Hill and... Smurfberry Hill? Yeah, and all of a sudden, this stuff fell on me and... Stuff? Like powder? Yeah! Uh-oh! And I have to tell Papa Smurf so he can treat me back to normal! Wait, there's no need to tell Papa Papa, Papa Smurf. Oh? Uh -huh. I mean, uh, look around you. Now you can do things the rest of us can only dream of, right, Smurf? <laughs> uh, yeah! Why, you... Why, you're the strongest Smurf in the world! Hey! That's true! I'll bet I can clean all the rocks on the Smurfette's garden in a flash! No, Hefty! Wait! My garden! Oh, don't worry, Smurfette! It's no big thing when you're a big Smurf! Creamy, how did all this get started? It um, does pose a mystery, doesn't it? <laughs> there, Smurfette! How's that? I guess I don't know my own strength. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we better go get Papa Smurf. Wait, um, um, Papa Smurf's off on important business, and we shouldn't bother him with our little problems. Little problems? And now, I'm gonna do something I always wanted to do. I'm gonna capture Gargamel. Oh, no. Hefty, wait! Oh, please don't do this! 
Suzuki. Bartholomew's dangerous. Not anymore. He's about to meet his match. Me! <laughs> Oh, don't you first worry about a thing. I know exactly what I'm doing. I'm going to get Papa Smurf. Yeah! I've created a monster. Oh, I hate this kind of weather. Sunny, bright, and cheerful. The kind of day when those rotten Smurfs have lots of fun. Yuck. If I could get my hands on just one of those vile, despicable little creatures, I'd wipe the grin off his little blue face. Don't oh, let go, fur brain. I told you not to interrupt me when I'm feeling sorry for myself. Watch this. I must be dreaming. End of the line, Gargamel. Smurf. You may be big, but I'm still bigger. <laughs> so what? I gotcha! <laughs> Why, you impudent little... Crying won't help, so save your breath. I'm taking you back to the village as my prisoner. That's what you... Your village? You heard me. Now march. Oh, oh, you've got me. Oh, please, please don't hurt me. Oh, I hope I can free myself before he grabs that even bigger net on the wall. Now I got your ball. Oh, you certainly do. Psst, Asia, play along. This is our free ticket into the Smurf Village. <laughs> the catapult's ready, Papa Smurf. All right, Andy. Now let's see if we can enlarge these clouds enough to bring some rain. Papa Smurf! Papa Smurf! Oh, Papa Smurf, come quick! Smurfette, what's wrong? Hefty's grown into a giant, and... A giant? Yes, and now he's going to capture Gargamel. It sounds like someone's been smurfing with my enlarging formula. Quickly, to the village! Oh, Smurf is me. This is terrible, and it's all my fault. Your fault? <gasps> so, Bartley! I should have known! Wait till Papa Smurf finds out. Hey, Smurfs! Your problems are over. Look what I got! <gasps> Gargamel! Azriel! There's nothing to fear. I've single-handedly captured them once and for all. That's what you think. Oh, gonna be difficult, huh? Well, I'm gonna smurf you a lesson you'll never... Ooh. Hey, no fair! Put me down, Buster! <laughs> yeah. Now to get the rest of them, Azriel! <laughs> oh, Papa Smurf, what are we gonna do? This mixture caused our problems, but maybe it can also solve them. My little Smurfs will have to work fast. Here's what I want you to do. <laughs> At last, you're mine, all of you! <laughs> oh, oh, Azrael! Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> you over here, that you can't catch Making a fool of you, Azriel! Can't you catch those puny little pea brains? Azriel, here we are! Ready, Smurfs? Jump! Azriel, you let them outsmart you! You're a miserable fur brain failure! Such clumsy incompetence will not go unpunished, Azriel. Therefore, I have decided to keep all of these Smurfs for myself. Mm. Azriel, what? Now, 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 no, Azriel, I was only joking. I, I, I'll let you have a few of the Smurfs. Lots of the Smurfs. All of the Smurfs? Yay! Ouch! Yikes! Okay, 
Oh, I didn't mean it, Azriel. I didn't. I was only joking. <laughs> See? I'm laughing. <laughs> but I may start crying. Soon. <laughs> A little of this elfin root should bring things back to normal. Thanks, Papa Smurf. Being big was okay for a while, but it can get lonely at the top. <laughs> As for Azriel, in time the mixture will wear off, but not before he's chased Gargamel too far away to ever find the village again. And now it's time to clean up this mess. Brady! Yes, sir, Papa Smurf. Right here, Papa Smurf. Um, er, uh, uh, Papa Smurf, being cleverly brilliant, couldn't you just sort of whip up a cleaning potion that I could use instead? Another potion? Oh, no! No potions! How dare you, Brainy Smurf! J -j just kidding! Help! Papa Smurf, help! <laughs> I think the first thing Brainy has to clean up is his act. <laughs> Smurf, huh? I think you're absolutely smurfly right. Help! 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 Whoa! Whoa, hi there, Blaine. Is it hot enough for you? Summer heat burns your feet by Poet Smurf. Rhyme the egg on the rock. Sounds amazing. Dear diary, it is so hot today that... Well, now, this makes 408 in just 17 minutes. Most interesting. Most interesting! That makes 7,207 since this morning. I predict a good year, a very good year. I tell you, Azriel, it's a masterpiece of modern engineering. A masterpiece! Why, if it weren't for this blasted heat, this would be child's play. Save me! You, this wretched heat! Ah, but it's worth it. This is one scheme that'll take him by surprise. This is one scheme that will not fail. Think of it, Azriel. The destiny of the Smurfs is in my hands. Soon there'll be no more. <laughs> amazing. Absolutely amazing. Phew, it's warm. Uh, perhaps I'll just join dear Lacey here in a little nap. Oh, um... Oh, Azriel, it won't be long now. Soon this dam will cut the flow of water to the river Smurf. And then those rotten little beasts will run out of water. <laughs> and when they do, they'll come up here. And when they do, with their first little tongues hanging out, I'll open the gates <laughs> and wash them all away. You know, Vanity, the mind of Smurf cannot truly soar until we stamp out the lethargy that infects our society. I was saying to Papa Smurf just the other day that it only takes... A few more hours, Azriel, and this great work will be completed. A monument to my diabolical cleverness. Unpreparedness. Just think what might have happened if that fire had smurfed at night. Oh. Just think what might have happened if this had been some smurf's house. Oh. I want you all to know I am well aware that what happened this afternoon was all my fault. Oh. When I think what might have happened to poor Lazy, I just shudder to imagine the dire consequences. 
That's what I love about Papa. He's so, so smurfy. Therefore, I want all of you to think very hard and come up with a plan for fighting fire. The smurf with the smurfiest plan gets an extra smurf berry pudding every day for a month. Yay! Greedy smurf, if this isn't the silliest thing I have ever smurfed, who ever heard of a fire extinguisher that squirts whipped cream? I mean, really greedy. Just a quarter of an ounce of common sense would tell you that this system is not efficient. The whole idea of using whipped cream to smother a fire while corrected principle is... Papa Smurf! You know, Harmony, this is really a waste of time. I have some plans in mind that make this contraption of yours seem naive in the extreme. Yes, as I was saying to Papa Smurf just this morning, if ever there was a need to demonstrate the folly of this kind of competitive endeavor... Papa Smurf! Hello? Hello in there, Andy Smurf. It's me, Brainy Smurf. I thought perhaps you might wish to enlist my services. No, thank you. I don't think you understand. You see, I'm offering you my insight into whatever it is you're doing. Two minds are always better than one, and... Uh... No, thank you. Oh, uh, hi, Brainy. What's going on? What is going on, Clumsy, is that Handy Smurf is up to something and foolishly excluding every Smurf from participation. I've offered to help, but oh, no. He'd rather work alone. It is attitudes like this that foster the kind of divisiveness that no well-structured Smurf society can long tolerate. And I, for one, am going to tell. Hey, Brainy, what's divisiveness? <laughs> that is the silliest thing I have ever seen, Jokey Smurf. A triumph of absurdity over Smurf sense. If you for one moment expect every Smurf to put one of those dumb boxes atop his room, you have another think coming. How does it work anyway? Just pull that little string! <laughs> Let's go! Oh, 
Oh, it's dry, dry, dry. The river Smurf is dry. Oh, it's dry, dry, dry. Soon the Smurfs will really cry. Hey! Hee-ho! Hee-ho! What in the world is keeping them? Oh, it's dry, dry, dry. And no clouds up in the sky. There's barely enough for one load. It will have to do. Hurry! Something is very, very wrong. Why is there no water up river? It works, Azriel. It works. Soon those despicable little blue mice will come trudging up here to see what is wrong. And if all goes well, Papa Smurf will be leading the way. <laughs> I do not understand this at all. Surely there is a logical explanation. A landslide? Oh, it's dry, dry, dry. There's no water in the sky. Gargamel, why aren't they back? Maybe they had an accident. It's the fire engine! <laughs> so this is the cause of our sorrow. Your fault, you accursed cat! Where are you giving <laughs> Smurfs are missing. Oh, missing? Gargamel must have them. Not one Smurf, and it's all your fault, you stupid cat. No dinner for you tonight. 98, 99, no doubt about it. I took another count too, Papa Smurf. Choking and Grouchy are definitely missing. Gargamel must have Smurfed them when they were in the forest. Hefty, Brandy, Vanity, Smurf it. Follow me to Gargamel's. Yes, yes, Papa Smurf. Smurf. The rest of you will watch over Baby Smurf. Yes, Papa, Papa Smurf. Smurf. Cats are a nuisance. Do you hear, Azriel? You're a nuisance, nuisance, nuisance. Azriel, 
Now where did you go? Asriel! Asriel! Oh, stupid cat! Now be very careful, my little Smurfs, and very, very quiet. Yes, yes Father Smurf. Hefty and Smurfette, have a look in the cellar, and beware of Asriel. You two, come with me. Oh, it's dark in here, Hefty. Do you see anything? No, nothing. Oh, you scared me. <laughs> They're not here. Then let's go. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Did you smurf anything? Only a rat, Papa Smurf. And he hasn't seen a thing. Hmm, that's odd. All right, quickly now. Let's smurf out of here before Asriel shows up. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. I'm sorry, my little Smurfs. Jokey and Grouchy are nowhere to be found. Oh, gosh, Papa Smurf, if they aren't at Gargamel's, where can they be? I don't know, Clumsy. I don't know. Papa Smurf doesn't know. What can have happened? We checked every trail. Gargamel must have them. Papa Smurf said that Gargamel doesn't have them, and if Papa Smurf said so, then Gargamel doesn't have them, because Papa Smurf is always brainy. Oh, sorry, Papa Smurf. All right. Every Smurf gets some sleep. We'll continue searching tomorrow. Oh, poor Jokey. Poor, poor Grouchy. What could have happened? Where can they be? Oh, where can they be? Beyond the boundaries of time and space, my voice has gone to stop this race. Leave where you are. Come to this place. Now come to me. Come face to face. <laughs> Just in time for supper. <laughs> Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Azriel? 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 Azriel, I have your favorite for supper. Good night, Smurfette. Good night, Hefty. Good night, Rainy. Good night, Papa Smurf. Good night, Jokey and Grouchy, wherever you are. At last, at last, to think what I have been searching for, lo, these many years, is finally in my grasp. I hate grasp! <laughs> if I could think life was such a joke, I'd cry! And then we came this way, and uh, yes, yes, I'm sure it was this way. Uh, Azriel, here, yeah, kitty, 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 come to Gargamel. And then we came this way, Papa Smurf. Jokey, grouchy. And now this way, uh, Azriel. Come to Gargamel. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. And I tripped on a rock right here, Papa Smurf. Jokey! Crouchy! Jokey! Jokey! Azriel! Gargamel! Papa Smurf! What have you done with my cat, you disgusting blue pests? What have you done with my two Smurfs, Gargamel? What two Smurfs? You know very well what two Smurfs. If I had two Smurfs, I'd eat them. It would be your last meal, Gargamel. You tell him, Papa Smurf! You tell him! I'm right behind you! If you don't tell me what you've done with my cat, I'll have you all for supper! Take one more step, Gargamel, and you'll regret it! Don't make me laugh, you puny little blue runt! Be ready to run! Yes, Papa yes, Smurf. Smurf! That's far enough, Gargamel! Come no closer! I'll ask you again, Papa Smurf, where is my cat? <laughs> Oh, Chlorhydris, soon I shall be free of your curse. After all these years, to think I finally have the things I need to set me free. Ah, yes, here it is, here it is. Three whiskers from a yellow cat and the tear of a smurf. Oh, fortune has smiled upon me this day. I only need three whiskers and I have dozens. I only need one smurf and I have two. Freedom will soon be mine. Soon, soon, do you hear? <laughs> now, which of you will be the first to cry for me? <laughs> me? Cry? Don't make me laugh. I hate laughing. Cry you must, and cry you will. Uh, but first, the cat. Easy, my yellow one. Easy now. <laughs> oh, I am sorry, yellow cat. Sorry. And now, for that tear. It saddens me to make you cry, but I have no choice. It saddens me to tell you this, my little Smurfs, but I have no choice. We must face the possibility 
that Jokey and Grouchy are never coming back. Papa Smurf, say it isn't so. Please, say it isn't so. <laughs> Smurfette, we've looked everywhere, and Jokey and Grouchy are gone. Gone, gone, gone. Azriel, are you never coming back to me? I cannot force you to cry. I can only hope that my sad tale will move you to the tear that I so desperately need. Well, my name is Priscilla. My father is dead. My mother is a sick woman. She wants nothing less than a world without love. Oh! My father was the first victim. I hate victims! Ah, Priscilla, what a joy you are. I shall not be gone long, my sweet love. Be a good girl and remember how much I love you. I never saw my father again. My childhood was not a pleasant one. My toys would break. I never had any pets. There was no love in our home, and I was very lonely. This is the last one, Papa Smurf. Gosh, Painter, this is the best painting you've ever done. Looks like he can step right out of it. I wish he could, Clumsy. I miss him. I can't believe I would ever miss that fool cat. Asriel? Asriel? Go away! I can't believe they're gone. I can't believe it. Well, one day a handsome young prince arrived, and we fell in love. I don't know why my mother hated him so. I never understood her. Ah, Priscilla, my love, what a joy you are. I shall not be gone long, my sweet love. And when I return, we shall be married. And remember how much I love you. I never saw my prince again. There they go, Asriel. Get him, get him. Get him, you fool cat. Asriel, Asriel, is that you? Oh. And then, so that no one would ever love me, she turned me into the hag you see before you. Oh, the many years I've spent suffering the mockery of the peasants. Wobbly, wobbly, there goes ugly. Wobbly, wobbly, there goes ugly. Wobbly, wobbly, there goes ugly. Alas, your eyes are dry. I see my tale has not moved you to tears. I hate tears. I never cry. <laughs> That's why they call me Jokey. You ought to have Smurfette here. She'd cry for you. My time is running out, and without a tear, I'll stay like this forever. Well, um, can we go home? Yes. Oh, I am sorry, Yellow Cat. If I could give you back your three whiskers, I would. And as the river Smurf flows, so the river of life flows into the endless sea. And as every loving Smurf knows, the memory of loving grows and grows, and they shall always be. I hate this. I think I'm going to cry. <laughs> Oh, thank you. Thank you. I... I forgive you, Mother. Now can we go home? 97, 98, 99, 101! Yay! I don't know why I bother even feeding you, you worthless stupid cat. I'd be better off without you. Mrs. Hopper, 
Oh, better. Come on, Nap, it's getting late. Your baby fell out of the nest. Oh, well, there he goes again. The walnut tree by Gargamel? Gargamel? I have to take care of a baby bird. Tell Papa Smurf I'll be late for lunch. And when he finds out you're off on another mission of mercy, he's... Oh, Brainy, you know Nat would never be able to live with himself if he didn't help that little bird. <laughs> what was that? Hello there, Mrs. Blue Jill. You don't say. Well, cats will be cats. Now, let's have a look at you, Twitter. You're gonna be fine. Just fine. Hold on, Twitter. I'll have you home in a minute. For a tea sack, I'd be delighted, but I'm expected home for dinner. Asriel, uh, uh, where are you? Come out here, you sniveling cat. I brought you a friend. <laughs> this fishbone that was giving you all that grief. I must say, you were very brave. Good grief, Hasriel. Don't be such a coward. If you weren't so stupid, you'd know this fine specimen of a silver fang growler just wants to be friendly. <laughs> you might as well come down, Hasriel. You two are going to be working together. Me? Thank you for the delicious Smurfberry pie, Greedy. It was the best one you've ever made. I hope you saved a piece for natural Smurf. Oh, mm yum, -hmm. Not exactly. Oh, that's okay, Greedy. I'm sorry I'm late, Papa Smurf, but between the grasshopper, the bird, the bear, and the bunny, it's been another full day. You must be hungry, Nat. You missed both lunch and dinner. It was worth it, Papa Smurf, as long as the little lost bunny learned a lesson. Lesson number one, this is a smurf. Lesson number two, this is a smurf berry bush. Lesson number three, sit! I said sit! Moving on to lesson number four. Lesson number five, always be careful to avoid human traps, especially if they're made out of iron. They hurt the most. The subject of lesson number six was enthusiasm, Azriel, of which you are showing very little, very little indeed. <laughs> Goodbye, my friends. I'll see you tomorrow. And remember to beware of those iron traps. <laughs> this is a Smurfberry bush, and where there are Smurfberries, there are Smurfs. Yeah! Oh, look, Feathers. Down there, it's one of those iron traps, and some poor creature needs our help. Yeah! It sounds like an injured cat. <laughs> Don't you think that... Wouldn't it be more advisable if... Uh, perhaps if we slow down and... <laughs> I'll be back. I say we let the sleeping cat lie. It serves him right. Azriel is mean. Why should we help him? Because he'll die if we don't. Yeah, maybe we'll die if we do. Oh, dear. I wish Papa Smurf was here. I don't know what we should do. I say let's get out of here. Will not one of you help me free this poor beast from its suffering? Will not one of you allow yourselves to feel smurf for this poor, injured animal who cries out to you in pain? Oh, poor Asriel. Don't cry, it's all right, Asriel. We're only trying to help you. Phew, that's some trap. 
What we need is a big stick for leverage. Here, this ought to smurf the job. It's all right, kitty. That's a nice pussy cat. Mm, don't just stand there, Brainy. Help me. Papa Smurf is not gonna like this at all. Not one bit. Now, if I've said it once, I've said it a hundred times. Papa Smurf's not going to like this at all. We know, Brainy. You said it a hundred times. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, Azriel, the blindfold stole it. Uh, uh, uh. <sighs> Smurfs, you idiot, not dragons. <laughs> I'll numb numb you, you numbskull! All right, Smurf down! It's not what you think it is! Are you crazy bringing that monster killer cat into the village? <laughs> Smurf aside, let us have that wicked pussy cat, Ned! Never! I mean, never! All right, make room for Papa Smurf! Papa Smurf smurfing through! Nat, this time you've taken your love of animals too far. Right! But Papa Smurf, please, just look at him. <coughs> Good heavens, Azriel was caught in one of Gargamel's traps. Amazing! I ask you, Papa Smurf, does this pitiful creature look like a dangerous animal? It sure does! Papa, that pussy is a killer! <laughs> My little Smurfs, now I know we've all had our troubles with Azrael. I hate Azrael! We all hate Azrael! <laughs> Haven't I always taught you to love all creatures great and Smurf? But Papa Smurf, that mean pussy cat always chases the Smurf! Yeah, yeah. how about that? I say throw him out. This poor creature is a living being. Are we Smurf or not Smurf? Well, well. We can't let Ezreal die. Careful, Smurfs. Now, let's all Smurf together. Hee-ho! 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 What do you think, Papa Smurf? Well, Brainy, a leopard cannot change his spots. My thought exactly. Look, look, Growler, look! Smurf Prince! Whoa, oh boy, whoa! Don't you! Oh, oh, oh! Heal! Sit! Stay! Stop, you idiot! Get out of my face, Swamp Breath! Phew! Well, Azriel, I see we're looking very Smurfy this morning. what I'm afraid of. Look, look! <laughs> Fresh wagon tracks, and I smell smurf berries. We must be near the village. Did you hear that? I swear it's that worthless Azriel. Oh, Azriel! Azriel! Yeah, kitty, kitty! Azriel, you naughty kitty! <laughs> Papa Smurf! Oh no, Papa Smurf! It was just another one of Gargamel's tricks! No, Papa Smurf! I don't believe it! Where are you, pretty kitty? Now, do you believe it? Nat, Smurf out of there! Now, now, Ezra, just calm down. Gargamel can't find you here. Handy, hefty, get the flower wagon and hurry! Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. Is this any way to treat the Smurf who saved your life? <laughs> <laughs> You've got their scent, Growler. Now, attack! <laughs> Not so fast! Not so fast! Ouch! 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 
that you all respect me, Brainy Smurf. <laughs> I hate ants! Just imagine how unsmurfy life would be if we were all exactly the same. Vive la différence, eh, Papa Smurf? That's why East Side Smurfs like vanilla frosting. And West Side Smurfs prefer chocolate, <laughs> right? Yes, Henny, that's... <laughs> Azriel! Azriel! <laughs> Run, my little Smurfs! Right, but I think the Smurfs would rather play than exercise. But perhaps there's another way. I was just reading about the ancient Greeks and their Smurfic games. Games? <laughs> yes. Yes. I believe that's the answer. We'll put on the very first Smurfic games. Ah, dear cousin. It was good of you to visit as I prepare for my long journey. Oh, yes, yes, oh, yes. As soon as I heard you were uh, leaving, I hurried right over. But it's been 40 years. Pissy, pissy, pissy. I'm not leaving you a thing, Gargamel. Oh, uh, dear cousin, that was the last thing on my mind. I only hoped to ease your final journey. There is something very important you can do. Oh, anything, anything. Behind the seventh volume, on the third shelf, you'll find a small box. Yes. Inside the box, you will find a medallion. The medallion for sign. Oh, it's uh, uh, most interesting. And dangerous. It's it, it dangerous? Deadly. Within this medallion is embodied the power of total destruction. Uh, indeed. It must Never fall into evil hands. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, oh, oh, it certainly mustn't. My friend here knows what to do. A smurf, Betty Bird? Goodbye, my pet. Yeah, but, but where is he going? To Papa Smurf. Papa Smurf? A true friend. Papa Smurf will know what to do with that cursed medallion. Ooh, Papa Smurf, eh? And now, cousin. I must be going. A new world awaits me. Uh, well, uh, uh, toodaloo. Uh, oh, oh, uh, uh, anything more that I can do? Uh, uh, help you with your will? I am leaving you nothing, Gargamel. Nothing! Nothing, eh? <laughs> well, cousin, you've left me everything a brilliant wizard could ever... <gasps> oh, no. No, no, no. No! No, not the magic books! Come back! Not the castle, too! Yeah! I'm glad you're gone, you old fool! I tell you, Azriel, he left me nothing! Nothing, nothing! <laughs> oh, wait a moment. Not exactly nothing. Hmm. Unlocking the power within the medallion of Poseidon. <laughs> What good is this book when the medallion is with Papa Smurf? In the village. 
Why, of course. I'll unleash the medallion's power and annihilate those stinking rotten smurfs. All of them. Oh, thank you, cousin. Oh, thank you. You left me something after all. <laughs> my little Smurfs, 10 sporting events for the first Smurfic Games. Yeah! <laughs> As Smurfic judge, I will be in charge of organizing the Smurfic Games. Furthermore, if you wish to enter the Smurfic Games, here are the 10 events for which you must... Who made him judge, judge anyway? Well, look at it this way. If he isn't the judge, he might end up on your team. Oh, oh good point. Swimming, weight Smurfing, and the most demanding event of all, the Smurfathon. Yeah! Gosh, I'd love to win the Smurfathon. <laughs> uh, what is it? And the team who wins the most events will receive the first Smurfic Games medal. Yeah! Oh boy, a medal. I hate medals. Ah, oh, it makes me happy to see my little Smurf so enthusiastic. Come on, we can go after Oh, yes. And then, the baby bear said to the papa bear... Why, hello there, little bird. What do you have there? <gasps> the medallion of Poseidon. <sighs> this can only mean my dear friend Argus has gone to his new world. Oh, my, this is dangerous. No danger, Azriel. <laughs> A few minor ingredients. A little ritual, and the entire Smurf village will be obliterated. <laughs> Let's see now. To activate the medallion, we'll first need to get hair from a bear asleep in its lair, dragon fire, and an ogre's underwear? Well, if this is all it takes to unlock the power within the medallion, I see no problem at all. None at all. <laughs> uh, one, uh, two, uh, oof, uh, three, uh, four, uh, five, uh, six. Smurfic games or no Smurfic games, I must get rid of this medallion before it destroys us all. Ah, there she is. <laughs> One coming up, or I should say, coming out. Now to find a dragon. Attention, please. As Smurfic judge, I decree the first thing we must do is divide into teams. Oh, gee, Brainy, how do we do that? Why, east versus west, of course. So, if your house is on the east side of the line, you are a member of the east team. Like me! And if you live west of the line, you are a member of the west team. <laughs> west is best, I always say, Hefty. I hate lines! Listen, Hamby, we eastern Smurfs will leave you in the dust! Yeah! Oh, yeah? Well, anybody who says Smurflower seeds instead of Sunflower Smurfs hasn't got a chance! Right, team? Yeah! Uh, Hey, everybody! What about me? Uh, which team am I on? Uh, <laughs> uh well, you can be on Handy's team, Clumsy! Oh, no, that's all right. Uh, yeah, 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 you can be on Handy's team! No, 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 I insist! The West team needs you! Yeah, but the East team needs you more! No! You, you can, can have, have him! him. No, no! You can, can have, have him! him. No, 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 no. Neither of you can have him! What do you mean, Smurfette? Clumsy and I are going to form our own team. We are? Gosh! <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's the funniest thing I ever heard. You won't win a single event. Maybe not, but we'll have a good time. Uh, yeah! After all, winning isn't everything. Are you kidding? It's the only thing! Now, let's be neighborly about this. All I did was borrow a little jar of fire. <laughs> Well, Asriel, I have the bear hair and the dragon fire. Now all we need to release the medallion's deadly power is an ogre's underwear. Splash, splash, splash. Big mouth take a bath. Splash, splash, splash. Look, Big look, mouth Asriel. take a bath. An ogre's underwear. Big mouth take a bath. Hey. What Gargamel do with Big Mouth underwear? Making a circus dance, you evil 
brain lumbox. <laughs> Big Mouth love underwear. Big Mouth need underwear. Big Mouth's underwear never fit Gargamel. Thank goodness the moon is full. Oh, medallion most deadly, by moonlight I toil to make thee inactive beneath moonlit soil. Oh, medallion most deadly, neath this earth may you rest. May your evil be silenced. Know that goodness is best. There. Phew. Well, at least it didn't fall into the wrong hands. Now the medallion will stay quiet as long as it remains buried. I wonder what Papa Smurf is up to. Even Papa Smurf is not above the scrutiny of the Smurfic judge. <gasps> now, what have we here? I'll bet this is the Smurfic medal. I wonder why Papa Smurf buried it. Why, of course. Oh, Papa Smurf, you are so foolish sometimes. If you wanted to put it in a safe place, why didn't you ask me? Now look at this. It's rusted already. I'll have Painter Smurf it up a bit. Oh, Papa Smurf will be so pleased. Behold, the gold medal Smurfique. <gasps> oh, Painter, it is truly worthy of my praise. But don't you think it would look just a bit better with glasses? That's the way, team. This is the best way to get in shape. <laughs> my machine's out Smurf you by a mile. Yeah? Well, real Smurfs do it this way. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. These Smurfic athletes require lots of nourishment. Say, Greedy, uh, can I have one of those cupcakes? Sorry, Taylor, I am withholding all goodie baking services from the East. No more cupcakes. Whoa! Well, in that case, I'm withholding all tailoring services from the West. No more suits. Whoa! Then I shall be forced to withhold all my musical services from the East. No more music! Yeah! Welcome to the Smurfic Games, starring Brainy Smurf. First, we shall practice some Smurfic cheers. Yeah! Now repeat after me. Brainy, Brainy, Brainy. Brainy, Brainy, Brainy. I hate Brainy, Brainy, Brainy. flag in the world! A handsome westerner salutes his flag, his noble head high, his steely eyes blazing with pride. Oh, patriotism is so smurfy. We, we are, are the East. West is the East. West is West is the East. We are the East. Here comes our third team, which I might add doesn't have a chance. La 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 Oh, I hope every Smurf notices our flag. I made it myself. Look at that flag! It looks like something the cat smurfed in. Don't listen to them, Clumsy. I think our flag is beautiful, and I'm proud to be on your team. And now, my little Smurfs, the moment you've all been waiting for, the lighting of the Smurfic flame. Let the games begin. Sugar and cream. Disqualified, disqualified. Smurfic rules specify that Smurfic athletes may not eat their equipment. <laughs> Judging the Smurf berry toss can be hazardous to your face. And now for the three-way wrestling match. Yay! 
We'll soon find out who's numero sumo. Yeah? Well, I can already feel the metal around my neck. Oh, this looks like fun. Whee! Clumsy! And now for the first winter event, the ski jump. Yay! Happy! Handy's team has won three events. Yay! Yes! Hefty's team has won three events. Yay! Yes! And Clumsy's team, though it defies all logic, has also won three events. Yay! Yay! I hate cheering. Thus, the winner of the first Smurfic Games will be decided by the tenth and final event, Clumsy! the grueling Smurfathon. Gosh! Uh... Good luck in the Smurfathon, Smurfette. Oh, I'm not running in the Smurfathon, Clumsy. You are. Me? But Smurfette, you're a much better runner than I am. Oh no, Clumsy. You've trained so hard for this event. I want you to represent our team. You can do it, Clumsy. I believe in you. On your marks, get set, Smurf. Run, Clumsy, run! Oh, uh, yeah! <laughs> 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 Take the ogre's underwear, add the hair from a bear, pile them together on a mountain in the air, set them aflame with the dragon's fire, chant these words as the fire grows higher, hear me Poseidon as I implore, bring forth the power of the earth's molten core. What's that? Ravage the land and stick. Azriel! Come back here, you cowardly flea bag! You miss my finest hour! Forget it, Handy! West is second best! Oh no! Handy, look out! Handy! Where are you? Where are you, Handy? I'm here! Don't worry, I'll save you! <laughs> Keep talking! I'll find you! Gosh, they're not even inside. West is the east. West is the east. Look, everybody, look. Who is it? <laughs> it's Happy. No, course. it's Handy, you fool. No, no, it's it's Clumsy. I, I, I'm sorry, Smurfette, but I just can't Smurf another inch. <laughs> Besides, what difference does it make? I'm last anyway. Oh, but you're not last. Clumsy, you're first. Just use your second wind, Clumsy. I already used my second wind, Smurfette. Back at the start of the race. Oh, please, Clumsy. I know you have an extra reserve of strength. If you truly want to win, you must reach down deep inside yourself for that last ounce of energy. Yeah! Oh, you can do it, Clumsy. You can do it! Thanks, Hefty. He would have won, you know. Well, who cares about winning? The important thing is your old pay. I tell you, Grouchy, there is something above this prize. Hear me, Hear me Poseidon, me. as I implore. Bring forth the power of the Earth's molten core. Yes! Something is dreadfully wrong. Wait, the metal is... The Papa Smurf! Ravage the land as never before. Total destruction from mountain to shore. What have I done? The medallion of Poseidon is an earth surf. It's a surfquake. It's an Oh, 
call on you. Forces of all that's smurfy and true. The doubt of your power shall reign no more. Buried forever in the Earth's molten core. No! I'll be crushed! Bam! Somebody! Anybody! What Gargamel do with Big Mouth's underwear? Oh, well, uh, you see, uh, uh, Mr. Big Mouth, I... I uh, that is... Uh, <laughs> Okay, Handy. This is the last one. We'll have it out in no time, old buddy. Ah, Grouchy, isn't it inspiring? East Smurf and West Smurf no longer on opposite sides. I hate opposite sides. Even though it took a natural calamity to... Natural calamity had nothing to do with this, Brady. I'm really sorry, Papa Smurf. I guess it was all my fault. But I've learned my lesson, Papa Smurf. I'll never meddle in your affairs again. Oh, no. Oh, what a tragedy. Our beautiful village will never be the same. We'll build a new village. Right, smurfier than ever before. And hope that never again will there be a line to divide us. Yay! Clumsy Smurf. It is with great pride I present you with this garland and crown you winner of the Smurfic Games. Yay! Oh, gosh, Papa Smurf, this is the Smurfiest moment of my whole life. <laughs> Hefty, my friend, I want to tell every Smurf how you saved my life. No, Handy, this is Clumsy's big moment. You're right. Oh, uh, hi, Handy. Hi, Hefty. Gosh, I'm sorry you fellas couldn't win, too. Oh, you deserve it, Clumsy. Besides, it's not whether you win or lose, it's how you smurf the game. Well, Papa Smurf, I shall begin preparations immediately for next year's Smurfic Games. Brainy! Yes, Papa Smurf? There aren't going to be Smurfic Games next year. There aren't? No! This has been so much trouble that from now on, the Smurfic Games will only be held every four years. A Smurfically brilliant idea. I was just going to suggest that myself. Scientific experiment, Asdiel. First, I must gather a great deal of clay. Oh dear! I wonder what terrible scheme Gargamel is planning. Ah, oh, Gargamel's not so tough. Shh! I promise you, Asdiel. This time, those pesky little Smurfs will be crushed so flat we'll have to eat them like pancakes. <laughs> Mmm, pancakes. Sounds good to me. Greedy. Let me at him. I'll give him a call with our lip. I'll... <laughs> Don't be a dope, Tuffy. We gotta find out what he's up to and warn the village. Whew. Well, that's the last load. Think of it, as Asriel. <laughs> Ten Smurfs with one stump. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. All I need now are a few ingredients. Some bad weather, a few magic words, and my beautiful giant will come to life. <laughs> a giant? Oh, we'd better tell Papa Smurf right away. <gasps> Tuffy, don't! <laughs> Smurf for your life! <laughs> <laughs> now, to collect some rotten eggs, some wormy crab apples, and some sour choke cherries. And, of course, build a kite. <laughs> That's all I need to bring my smurf crushing giant to life. Wow, oh, 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 oh. Huffy, get in here. Let's stand and fight instead of hiding like we're afraid. But, but we, we are, are afraid. Like 
you, Effie. You're his idol. From now on, the Smurf is on his own. Ah, so there you are, Osriel. <coughs> While you've been out playing, I've been gathering the ingredients which will bring my giant to life. See? I already have the bad apples and the rotten eggs. Come along, Osriel. All I need now is a handful of sour choke cherries. Yuck! And if he brings that giant to life, we won't stand a chance, Papa Smurf. Ah, uh, that giant didn't look so tough. That's because he wasn't alive yet. No, no, my little Smurfs. If I am correct, Gargamel cannot make his giant. Why not, Papa Smurf? Well, Gargamel needs choke cherries. And they simply don't grow in this part of the world. I can't find those choke cherries anywhere. Ouch! Ouch! Now, where in the world am I going to get? Smurf berries. The perfect substitute. <laughs> Why, those disgusting Smurfs think Smurf berries are good for just about everything. So why not my giant formula? Then me and Hefty knocked that cat silly. <laughs> of course, it was me that first stepped out to face that cat. But it didn't take good old Hefty long to join the fight. Fight? Fight? There was no fight. There was just two hits. Azrael hit you, and you hit the ground. Besides, you wouldn't stand a chance against that cat, and you know it. Hold it, Smurfs. You haven't heard the best part. I'll show them. I'll show all of them. Now, don't be going too far, Tuffy. There's a little storm brewing. I'm not scared of any storm. And I'm not scared of any cat, either. <laughs> this should do it, Osriel. <laughs> any moment now. <laughs> oh, you beautiful, disgusting stuff. <laughs> soon, my friend, soon. Powers of darkness, hear me well. Bring down the lightning, completing my spell. Give life to my giant and make him obey. Every order I give, be it night, be it day. I, 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 I'm almost afraid to, to, to lower the platform. It lives! It lives! <gasps> now, now, Mr. Giant, remember who created you. Remember who's responsible for bringing you to life. Remember, remember who loves you. Daddy! Ah, just the kind of rain my crops needed, Papa Smurf. I hope Tuffy didn't get waterlogged out there. Tuffy? Out in the storm? Yeah. I saw the little fella marching off into the forest a bit ago. Said something about not being scared of storms or cats. Oh, no! I told Tuffy he was a pushover for Azrael. Now he's gonna prove me wrong? Hmm. Tuffy's the kind of Smurf who'll do just that. What'll we do, Papa Smurf? If he's after Azrael, there's no time to lose. We must go to Gargamel's immediately. Now, pick me up, Doofus, and put me on your shoulder. Very good, Doofus. Very good. Now, let's go find a bunch of bad Smurf houses. We'll find them all. I can beat that stupid cat. No sweat. We'll find them all. I'll show all those scaredy cats who's boss. I'll... <sighs> Say, you're just the cat I wanted to see. I got a bone to pick with you, Sam and Brad. Put them up. Come on, give me your best shot. That, Doofus, is a wretched Smurf. Hmm. Now, if we followed him, he'd lead us right to his village, Doofus. <laughs> oh, goody! Then we play Stomp the Smurfs. Uh, yes, but first, we hide. Hide? How we hide? Behind that hill will do fine. Go! 
good, Doofus, good. Now, reach down into that lake and scoop up some cold water. When the little blue baboon sees Azriel, he'll head for the village like a shot. <laughs> what the? I did it. I did it. <laughs> I'll show Hefty who's scared of who. Oh, the idiot is taking Azriel with him. No, oh, no matter. Either way, he'll lead us to the village. Follow him, Doofus. But it's on tiptoe, please. Hey, there's Taffy. Say, Mr. Big Dragon, something. It looks like Azriel. Don't worry, I got this cat under control. Show me, me, Can't you ever stay out of trouble? This means big trouble. Smurfberry Fields, Doofus. The village must be nearby. We'll just stomp everything flat until we find it. We must warn the others. My poor Smurfberry crop. All set, Pop Smurf. You may fire when ready, Handy. <laughs> yummy, yummy. Yuck, phooey. How can they stand that stuff? Papa Smurf! There's no more pies! There's no time to take anything. Just run into the forest and hide. We'll all meet later at the Great Oak. Maybe we'll survive, but the village is lost. What's going on, Papa Smurf? You let Gargamel and his giant ride to our village. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm not afraid of any giant. Happy, come back here! There's a Smurf! Stomp him, Doofus! Stomp him! But Smurf's nice! 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 How can you say that? They feed doofus pies. Me no want to smash them. Me want more pies. I told you those rotten Smurfs can't be trusted. No, you big cry, baby. Look out! Well, we have to start all over again. Hello, Smurfs. <gasps> Smurfs have more pies? You ruin our Smurfberry crop and smash our houses, and now you want pies? Are you looking for another fight? <laughs> Me sorry. Darn, how can you be mad at a giant who says he's sorry? It's just as I suspected, Tuffy. Gargamel must have used Smurf berries instead of choke cherries in his formula. And the result <laughs> is a gentle giant that loves Smurf berry pies. If I didn't see it, I wouldn't believe it. Now, another set of furrows to the edge of the forest should finish the job. <laughs> the big fella's got a green thumb, just like me. <laughs> yes, but his is much bigger. Hooray for Doofus! Yay! Since you like my pie so much, Mr. Doofus, I made this one especially for you. Ooh, yummy, 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 yummy. Time to go bye-bye. Oh, Doofus, please stay for supper. No, thank you, Smurfette. Daddy wants Doofus home before dark. <laughs> For water-loved woodwinds. It's so hard to look your best during an emergency. Baby, has any Smurf seen Baby? Thanks, Smurf, this baby's safe. Ow! Uh, I'm coming, Brady. Well, it's about time, Clumsy. What took you so long? Uh, sorry, Brady. What do we do now? Don't rush me, Clumsy. I have just had a harrowing experience. I say we all smurf together to stop this flood. Exactly what I was thinking, Smurfette. We should look for something we can use to plug that geyser. Just as I was saying, Clumsy, why don't you look for something to plug that geyser? Uh, how about those rocks, Brady? Don't be ridiculous, Clumsy. Those rocks are much too heavy. They're perfect. We can drop one of them to plug the hole. Absolutely. That's what I thought, too. Good thing I spotted them, huh, Smurfette? No wonder Papa Smurf left us both in charge. Every Smurf, gather round! 
down. You heard us. Get Smurfing on the double. Every Smurf, push! We all did it! Together! What an awful mess! Scuffle Let's make mud pies! Snappy, we still have to find Grandpa's box! Impossible! It is like finding the needle in the mud pack! Uh, we can't give up! We'll just have to start smurfing all over again! Uh, right, Smurfette! Uh-oh! I'd better get my charts again! <laughs> uh. <laughs> Very funny, baby. Whoa! <laughs> Easy for you to laugh, smurfing on a nice dry box. Huh? Box? Hey, every smurf, I found it! I found Grandpa's box! <laughs> uh, I mean, Baby and I found it. <laughs> Okay, okay, baby found it. I was hoping we could avoid them. They look very unsmart. What are they, Grandpa? Fierce wooden warriors known as the Tikis. They do not smurf kindly to visitors. In fact, I said, they toss them into their volcano. Last time on Tiki Island, I barely escaped that fate myself. Then we must be doubly careful, my little Smurfs. Slippery sandworms, Grampy. Why don't we just tiptoe around the Tikis? Alas, the path we seek is their path, too. Huh? I think Grandpa means the Tikis are in our way. Uh, I just knew that's what he meant. Oh, what a time to run out of Smurf fairies. Well, he don't scare me. Now, my little Smurfs. Mmm, mmm, this is too good to pass up. Breathy, come and pop a Smurf. Oma Tiki. Trot Tigers, that Tiki's got greedy, Poppy. Maybe I can distract that walking wood pile if you youngins can do the rest. Huh? Look out, look out. Oh. Now, Handy, push. Almost done, guys. Come on, Greedy. Freedy, your stomach almost put our whole mission in danger. Sorry, Papa Smurf. What do you call that, Grandpa? A narrow escape. Oh, this. It's a Smurferang. Comes in mighty handy sometimes. Will you teach us how to throw it, Grampy? Will you? Not now, says it. We must climb to the top of the volcano. Hovering hummingbirds. There must be a could be rough smurfing, Grandpa. I know, Papa. I'll try not to lose you. Wait for us, Grandpa. Yay! Uh, uh, sorry to cut in. Uh, oh, don't, don't, don't stop dancing on our account. Uh, uh, we love dancing. Uh, right, Azriel? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I bet you're wondering why I dropped in. Uh, well, uh, 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 I'm looking for six little blue creatures about so high. Uh, uh, you haven't seen them by any chance. Oh, I, I can see you're a little upset. Uh, uh, I'll just find them myself. Uh, uh, come, Azriel. Yikes! This way, Azriel. No, no! Keep 
Come on, Smurfs. Now we go this way. Every squirrel. Isn't this fun, Happy? <laughs> fun? I might call it that if I could catch my breath. I know what you mean, Papa Smurf. <gasps> Hef, your face. You're getting Happy Whiskers on it. What about your hair? My hair? It's gray. Grandpa, what's happening to us? The power of the long life stone is fading rapidly. Then we don't have much time. We must get the final element, the ball of flame, before it's too late. Rainy, just what do you think you're going to do with that crowbar? I'm going to open the box, of course. Papa Smurf said we were supposed to find the box. He didn't say anything about opening it. He didn't say anything about not opening it. Yeah! Oh, Brady, are you all right? Maybe we should wait for Papa Smurf to get back. Oh! I got a wrinkle. No, two wrinkles. No, a dozen wrinkles. I need a mud pack. Bad. Smurfette, your hair! It's turning white! Oh, dear! What's happening to us? I hate what's happening to us. Efu-hefty, Smurfy does it! I'm trying, Andy, but catching a ball of flame isn't as easy as snagging a Smurf ball, you know. And my hand's not as steady as it used to be. Let me give you a hand, Hefty. Together, maybe we can catch one of these fireballs. Sure, Grandpa, we can do it. I hope. Oh, no, look! The rope's on fire! They know, Handy. They know. So much at stake. So little time. Swooping swallows! Come on! You can do it! I know you can! Quick, every smurf! Oh, before the rope breaks! We're smurfing as fast as we can, Papa Smurf! Smurfs, but we still must get them back to the village. Happy homing pigeons! We're gonna make it, Crampy! Oh, not a moment too soon! My aching bones tell me our time is short! Hurry, my little old Smurfs. We must get back to the boot. Now, that would have been a tough run even when I was young. <sighs> the boot is gone. Oh. I can't see hiding a Smurf of it. Well, it wouldn't just run away and leave us, would it? No boot could be that much of a heel. Look around, my Smurfs. We must find it, or all is lost. A boot! Where are you? What you see, Grandpa? Trouble. Big trouble. Our boot's gonna be sacrificed to the Tiki Volcano. Pray, Smurfs, we've got to stop it. Hold it, Papa Smurf. Rampy's falling behind. Uh, I'll never make it. Go on without me. We're not leaving you, Grandpa Smurf. We either go together or not at all. Oh, no! Close, Azriel. No, oh, I hate those tikis almost as much as I hate the Smurfs. Oh, my tiki, oh, my tiki. Yeah. 
One step at a time, my ancient Smurfs. Grampy, are you okay? Yes, it's tired, Bright Eyes. Keep climbing. You must save the boot. Oh, oh, oh my Smurfness, oh we're too oh late. Oh my <gasps> We still have a slim chance to save it if we can smurf close enough to use Andy's winch. We're right behind you, Papa Smurf. It's all downhill from here, Grampy. Now to figure out a way to get out of... Watch your step, my little Smurfs. <gasps> the Smurfs! We made it, Grampy! It's no use, Sunset. We've failed. But we still got what we came for, Grandpa. Wrong! I do! Yes, it's me. I followed you to the four corners of the world to get my hands on this treasure. Gargamel, listen to me. Papa Smurf. Boy, and I thought I had a rough day. You don't understand. The treasure is useless to anyone but the Smurfs. Save your breath, Papa Smurf. Sounds like you need it. Come, Azriel. We're not falling for their tricks this time. <laughs> Just help me! Yeah. Sounds sincere. You don't know Gargamel, Grandpa. Throw us the treasure first, then we'll help. <laughs> Whatever you say. <laughs> here. Oh. Come on, let's smurf out of here. Help. But what about Happy Gargamel? We can't leave him like this. Right, Sasset. A promise is a promise. What? That wicked wizard's always breaking promises. But we can't. It's the Smurf way. And if we stopped being Smurfy, even on our last day, we wouldn't be Smurfs anymore. We'll save you, Happy Gargamel. Just hang on. I'm hanging, I'm hanging, but hurry! Oh, my little Smurf. Oh! oh. He's too heavy, Papa Smurf. Pull harder, you little blue twerps. Can't pull any harder, Papa Gargamel. I think we've got him now, Papa. Whoa! None of us on the boot. So that's how Gargamel found us. Take cover, my little gray-haired Smurfs. Quick, in here. Poor Papa Gargamel. Sound. Eh? I hear 
something, but I can't see anything. What's that? We're being invaded. <laughs>
Don't scare him away, Brainy. I'd like Grandpa to tell me about his travels. What about the animals he's seen? Ah, uh, skip all that. Just tell us the adventures, Grandpa. We Smurfs could learn a lot from you, Grandpa, if you want to stay. The wise man says, when so many hearts speak at the same time, only a fool would shut his ears. Papa Smurf, does that mean he wants to stay? I certainly think so, Hefty. Yippee! Smurfaroo! Oh, how wonderful! And I'm gonna start fixing a lifelong banquet in Grandpa's honor. I'll compose the tribute. Oh, to the wandering Smurf who's returned home after all these many long years. I'll do the floral arrangements. What's wrong, Sasset? Aren't you happy Grandpa is staying here from now on? Singing songbird, Pappy. Of course I am. I love Grampy. I was just wondering whatever happened to poor Pappy Gardamil. Oh, I have a feeling we haven't seen the last of him. Uma titi, uma titi, uma titi, uma titi. Ooh, this is all the fault of those little blue figures. I hate Smurfs. I hate Smurfs. I hate I don't think that balloon. Be careful, Snappy. Ah, uh, this is a stitch. It's just like falling off a log. Whoa! Uh, I can't look. I fooled you. <laughs> oh, Snappy, that's not funny at all. <laughs> You're just a scaredy smurf. Watch this. <laughs> Cake certainly smells delicious, Greedy. Thanks, Papa Smurf. It's frosted with my special coconut icing. Just wait till you taste it. Look out! <laughs> Snappy, what's the meaning of this? I was walking across my tide rope, and I guess I fell. Thanks to you, I'll have to start all over on a new batch of coconut icing. And I don't have many coconuts left. Oh, I'm sorry, I was just having fun. There's a difference between fun and recklessness, Snappy. And recklessness causes trouble for everyone. Especially me. According to Greedy, the only coconut tree in the forest should be just up ahead. There they are, the last coconuts of the season. I'll climb up and toss them down. All right, Snappy, but please be careful. Now keep your ears open and your eyes peeled, Asriel. Those smurfs could be anywhere. Here comes another nut. Catch! There's one now. <laughs> Smurf a roof. This is fun. I got it. I got it. I got it. Stop playing games, Snappy. Those nuts are for dessert. <laughs> and you're the main course. <gasps> Gargamel! Quick, Snappy, take cover. All right, Smurf, where are you? Right under your nose, Gargamel. <gasps> Snappy! Gotcha! <laughs> Wrong, Gargamel. Ouch, you pesky Smurfs. I'll get you all. Oh, 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 oh. Ouch, Run! Ready, aim, smash! Oh. Yeah! This time your recklessness almost got you caught, Snappy! Drat! Those rotten Smurfs always get away! If only they were all as reckless as that little one in the tree! Yeah. That's it! I'll make them all reckless! Ah! Here it is! Daredevil dust! One touch of this magic powder, and those Smurfs will throw caution to the wind. Why, they'll practically hurl themselves at my feet. <laughs> the coast is clear. Gargamel's gone. Unfortunately, so are the Puka Nuts. We threw the last ones at Gargamel. We'd better return to the village and tell Greedy. I'm afraid he will be very disappointed. You should think more about the consequences of your actions, Snappy. If you go recklessly through life without looking ahead, there's no telling what will happen. Yay! <laughs> See what I mean? Uh, uh. Smurfaroo! Look at that weird bird! <gasps> That's no bird! It's bird-brained Gargamel! Faster, you miserable fool! 
feline faster! Soon the whole forest will be covered with my daredevil dust. Then those rotten smurfs will come running to me! <laughs> hey, what's he spraying? I don't know, but we better warn Papa Smurf. Papa Smurf! Papa Smurf! Hey, what's smurfing on? Uh-oh, that dust is falling on him! Hey, great Smurfs! All of us at night feel so... so reckless! <laughs> yeah, me too! <laughs> <laughs> Papa Smurf, hefty! <laughs> Smurf, what are you doing? Having a wonderful time. Wish you were here. <laughs> but, but that looks dangerous. From now on, danger is my middle name. Gargamel's dust is making Papa Smurf and Hefty act strange. Very strange. Come on, Granny. They're heading back to the village. Come back here, you. <laughs> Chasing this tiny frog. I'm gonna catch the biggest frog in the world. The Garumpa. <laughs> Whee! Uh oh, we're too late. <laughs> oh, but Smurf would be furious if he could see this. Yoo-hoo! Snappy! Brainy! Join the fun! <laughs> oh no, this is worse than I thought. I've got to find the cure. <gasps> Whee! <laughs> Clumsy! Are you all right? What happened? <laughs> A bunch of us are taking turns on the catapult. <laughs> but you hurt yourselves. Who cares? <laughs> I do. Ah! I will. I will. Hi, Grandpa. I'm going to take you home with me. I will. <laughs> Come along, Azriel. It's time for picking Smurfs. Ah, here they come now. How do you do, Gargo Spell? This is too easy. I should have thought of this years ago. <laughs> Forgetful fog? No. Pugnacious potion? No. Smurf out of the way! I don't believe it! <laughs> Here I come! Are you all right, Papa Smurf? Never felt better in my life! Oh, no! This is all Gargamel's fault! Gargamel! <laughs> How dare he chase us all these years? I'm going to give that wizard a piece of my mind. No, that's too dangerous. He'll eat you or, or, or turn you into gold or do whatever he does. Step aside, Brainy. Papa Smurf, wait. You've got to think about the consequences. Oh, I don't care about any consequences. Let us out of here. I hate cages. Quiet, you little blue ninnies. Soon I'll have all the Smurfs under lock and key, and I owe it all to you, my lovely daredevil dust. Open up, Gargamel. Papa Smurf, what a pleasant surprise. Never mind the small talk. I have a few things to say to you. Why, you can talk all you want. After I lock you up. <laughs> 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 really? Weren't you affected by Gargamel's dust? Dust? I've been making a new batch of coconut icing all day. Mm. And it's as so smurfy as ever. Hmm, that's strange. Gargamel's dust affected every smurf but you. Oh, Snappy! What's this? I'm fine. In fact, I feel smurfy again. That's it. <laughs>
What we need is... Snappy, I found the cure. It says here, the only way to reverse the effects of daredevil dust is to bathe in the juice of... Fungi oh, Match! We know, Grady, we know. Oh. Greedy, we'll need all your leftover polka nuts. But I made them all in icing. Then we'll just have to improvise. Bullseye! <laughs> 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 Get back here, you blue baboon! Bitch, you can't catch me! <laughs> Unbelievable! I've made you so reckless, you're not even trying to escape! <laughs> Why, Shirley, this is much more fun! We're not afraid of you anymore! What's that? going on here? That's what I'd like to know. Smurf for your lives! Come back here! Run away from me, will you? I'll show you. Get ready for the most powerful anti-smurf potion ever made. One drop of this, and there will be no more... My little Smurfs, I'm glad we're finally all Smurfing sound. Wait a minute, where's the set? Hi, everybody. Look what I caught. <gasps> the the Rapper! Puff and Horn Toads, aren't you impressed? Why, we're uh, greatly impressed, Sasset. In fact, I have a present for you. Oh. <gasps> Gargantuan guppies! What am I doing with them? Oh, uh, don't worry, Sussex. I'll take him back to the bog. Uh, that's very smurfy of you to volunteer, Snappy, but just to be on the safe side, you better take Hefty along. And above all, be careful. No problem, Papa Smurf. I've learned my lesson. Being reckless causes too much trouble. Uh, here's the rest of your pookin' nut pies, Gritty. <clears throat> I hate being reckless.